Here with head coach Sharice Galasso uh, here on Media Day WPI Women's Basketball and Coach, another year upon us. How has uh, preseason practice been so far? It's been great. Uh, the players have come back. They've worked exceptionally hard in the offseason. This fall they worked with our strength conditioning coaches, put a lot of time in, and our senior leaders have done a terrific job getting them prepared. So this first week of practice has been excellent. The energy is high. The, the work rate has been very, very high, higher than in the past. And, uh, we're really excited about the talent level that we have this year. And a lot of balance class-wise amongst your team, something that, that isn't always the case at the college level. Uh, talk about how you're able to achieve that and, and what the advantages is uh, to having that. I think um, I, you know, I have to credit our assistant coaches, particularly Coach Riley. Um, she and I have worked really hard over the past. This is her third year with the program, and we've worked uh, you know, to bring in some consistent classes. Uh, we've put a lot of effort into the recruiting process, trying to bring in quality student athletes, you know, good people that'll fit in the program and you know, I think that they've bought in and uh, that's why we're seeing you know, the results. Now, the schedule makers may not have done you many favors, but local basketball fans, they've done a lot of favors as we have a, just a really good city tournament to start the, uh, the season, Wish State, Becker and Clark. Uh, not easy to start in, in rivalry games and uh, you'll start that November 15th. Talk about the excitement around the Worcester City Tournament. It's always a great tournament, such a long-standing tradition in this area for women's basketball at the Division Three level, and uh, great coaches, great programs. So I know I think we're all excited to do it. While while it's not going to be easy, they're always challenging, and uh, the games are always really competitive. Um, I think all the teams are pretty excited about it. So I look forward to November fifteenth. It's going to be a good start. And a little bit of a change in the New Mac schedule, playing sixteen games, not twenty. So you don't play uh, New Mac right at Thanksgiving this time like you did in the past. But you still have some conference games the first half of the season. Is that something that you're used to the last few years or still a challenge? No, I think we've gotten used to it. Um, I mean, we're just looking at each game. Uh, every conference game is important. The New Mac is very competitive, a lot of parity in the league. Anyone can beat anyone, so every game really matters. Uh, you don't have time to, to get ready and be prepared towards the end of the season. So, you know, we open up a conference play right after Thanksgiving uh, with Coast Guard, and then we have Babson. So those will be two critical, very tough veteran teams that we're going to have to go up against. Um, so we'll, we'll get a test early and see where we're at right then and there. Well, but our non-conference schedule will probably uh, prepare us very well. We have a very strong non-conference schedule. So. Well, and we look forward to seeing you. 5 o'clock, November 15th, Worcester City Tournament, WPI and Worcester State get it kicked off. Becker and Clark at 7 o'clock, and uh, a pair of games the following day, Sunday, November 16th. Sharice, best of luck. We look forward to talking to you throughout the season. Thank you very much. Hi, Mom and Dad.